Today on Forbes, these Chinese AI companies could be the next DeepSeek. In January, a little-known Chinese AI lab named DeepSeek rocked the world when it released an advanced open-source model that rivaled those of U.S. tech giants, seemingly using a fraction of their resources. A who's who of AI's juggernauts, from OpenAI to Anthropic, lauded the company's achievements while defending their own progress and methods. President Donald Trump called it a, quote, wake-up call. But beyond that viral moment, spun up by AI's own frothy hype cycle and a frenzy of geopolitical concerns, DeepSeek's emergence had a deeper impact. It put a spotlight on Chinese AI and gave it a face on an international stage. DeepSeek and other Chinese companies were not included on our just-released AI50 list, which honors the most promising privately held companies in artificial intelligence because their financials and business practices are opaque. But they are worth highlighting as many of them make significant impacts beyond China, thanks to an emphasis on open source models made freely available for anyone to use. Many of the Chinese AI models gaining traction are made by the country's tech giants. There's video generation app Hanyuan, owned by tech conglomerate Tencent, the $92 billion in 2024 revenue maker of WeChat. The company claims its recent so-called reasoning AI models, which can answer complex questions by breaking them into smaller sub-questions, outperform DeepSeek's flagship models. Then there's Doubao, a consumer-focused app from TikTok parent ByteDance, which has built spatial models that analyze physical environments and generate 3D landscapes. There's also Quen, a family of large language models from the e-commerce behemoth Alibaba, which has amassed more than 90,000 enterprise users on the company's cloud platform. Rob Toes, a partner at Radical Ventures, told Forbes, quote, Alibaba is kind of the leading big tech AI champion in China, comparable to what Google or Meta represent in the US. As of the first publication of this story, models from Alibaba and DeepSeek were among the top five trending models on Hugging Face, a widely used hub for open source AI models and datasets. DeepSeek's meteoric rise opened the floodgates for other Chinese startups. In March, Wuhan-based startup Butterfly Effect launched an AI system called Manus, which it claims can autonomously browse the web and do things like search for apartments, analyze stocks, and design websites. The tool has some pitfalls, ranging from making incorrect assumptions about the task at hand, to crashing while processing large amounts of text. But its release was praised as an emerging rival to OpenAI's service, Operator. Fueled by the likes of Twitter co-founder Jack Dorsey, buzz around the company has drawn investor interest. Butterfly Effect is reportedly in talks to raise funding from US-based investors at a $500 million valuation, according to media outlet The Information. While DeepSeek built its models by fine-tuning other models from Meta and Alibaba, Manus managed to use Anthropic's Claude models off the shelf. Toes said, quote, It's basically a much better version of what OpenAI is trying to do with Operator. China has been making significant leaps in humanoid robotics, too. Ajabot, founded in 2023 by former Huawei so-called genius youth recruit Peng Zhihui, claims it has already manufactured over 1,000 AI-powered bipedal robots and reportedly plans to grow that number to 5,000 robots by the end of the year. This in a bid to match Elon Musk's plans for Tesla's general-purpose robot, Optimus. Earlier this month, the company hired Luo Jianlan, who previously worked at Google X, Alphabet's moonshot factory, to lead its research efforts. Aaron Jacobson, partner at venture capital firm NEA, said, quote, I hear about them when I'm talking with my robotics companies, and they're talking about competition they're seeing in China. This one's come up a few times now. For full coverage and to see the whole AI50 list, check out Richard Nieva and Rashi Srivastava's piece on Forbes.com. This is Kieran Meadows from Forbes. Thanks for tuning in.